My name's Lydia Simmons, and this is my brother, Stu. Is she doing anything else I should know about? She's doing a lot of things, but I don't think you should know about it. Ever since my dad returned from the war, things haven't quite been the same. You gotta put your arms around the woman every once in a while. She's gonna think you don't like her no more. Now, I'm giving you this advice, because I can see that you just don't know what you're doing. Do you want to do this all the same, Grace? But at least we're together again. Dear Lord, bless this food, please. <laughs> now it's summer in Mississippi. And us kids are building a house of our very own. Excuse me, fat girl. Is it absolutely necessary to serenade us? I'm gonna die, I hope you know, because I have a granular condition. That host is Twinkie's condition what you got. There's only one thing standing between us and a perfect summer. The Libnickies are coming! Get lost and leave the trolley. Hey, did you guys tell me about this place? Of course not. Well, you can cut off every hair in my head, but I ain't telling you ding dilly ding dilly ding dang dong. No. I better not to lay claim this here for you. Oh, you're too couple wild Indians, aren't you? Self-defense, Dad. Dark territory now. You went to war to fight for people you didn't even know. But in the end, I killed more people than I saved. This is our house. Don't you think we ought to fight for it? Don't you recall a damn thing Daddy's told us? Boy, well, sometimes all it takes is a split second to do something you regret the whole rest of your life. My mama says folks that treat people bad only do it because they're ignorant. Excuse me. She's gonna sit up front where she can see from now on. She ain't gonna go by color girl no more, neither. I don't know about you, but all my friends have names. Universal Pictures proudly presents Elijah Wood, Kevin Costner. From the director of Fried Green Tomatoes, The War. I hope you know them the kids who just beat me up. Know who they are, sir. Well, then why did you just give a mom and Lydia's cotton candy? Because it looked like they hadn't been given nothing in a long time. My daddy once said of fighting, we are meant for better things, you and I. In everyone's life, there is a time that will always be remembered. How long is this kid staying? Not long. Well, don't expect me to entertain him. For a boy named Willard, Sit down and I'll make you a really nice lunch. That time is now. What are you listening to? Rap. Rap. It details the common man's struggle for survival in a hostile environment. What? He's discovering what it means when two people drift apart. Can't make up my mind. Are you sick of me? Or are you just dead inside? And what it takes to bring them back together. How come you always do that? What? Make everything so hard. That's a good question. That's a very good question. They gave him a summer he'd never forget. Do you love them anymore? He gave them back the love they'd lost. Ben thinks you're beautiful. Melanie Griffith, Don Johnson, and Elijah Wood in Paradise. things because he liked doing them. Wouldn't you say he was evil? I don't believe in evil. You should. I let you go. You think you could fly? The good son. What do you think this is, a game? I 
After seven months of fighting, the civil war in Chateloup may have reached the turning point. The capital has just fallen. In December 1994, the forces of freedom will face a power-mad dictator in a struggle for the fate of the world. I don't think so. You'll have to do better than that. Okay. Yeah. Now, who wants to go home and who wants to go with me? Sisters, bound by love, <laughs> devoted to family. Father's Day. Happy Father's Day, Larry. Happy Father's Day, Larry. Our farm's been in the Cook family for a hundred years. We're going to form a corporation, and you girls will each have a third. What do you say? It's a good idea, Daddy. It's a great idea. I don't know. You don't want it, my girl. You're out. This is where we start working for ourselves. Tell me what you really think about Daddy. He's a bear. He's but... not a bear. He's not innocent like that. A lot of secrets around here. I'm so tempted to get in bed with Jess. People are getting suspicious, wondering how you and Rose got Larry to give you the place when the whole thing's obviously driving him crazy. <laughs> did we treat him badly? People seem to think we did. Threw a man off his own farm on a night you wouldn't keep a wolf out of your barn. Don't think you can treat me like this? Two girls that make me crazy! Touchstone Pictures proudly presents... A story of family. I thought I was special. Not you, not her. Acts of betrayal. You're gonna wreck my childhood for me. Tell me something terrible about Daddy. And affairs of the heart. I love you, Jess. I want what was Daddy's. I think I paid for it, don't you? I guess you just want everything for yourself. I always have. It's clear who's benefiting here. What happened to you? I give you everything. What do I get in return? They were more than family. They were sisters. A thousand acres. What kind of kid would rather sit in a crummy classroom than be out here? What kind of father goes fishing when he should be looking for a new job? Fine. Fine. And don't forget today. What's today? Election day, dummy. Well, I'm not even registered. I registered for you in the mail. Well, that's great. I could get jury duty now. Boom, 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 boom. Mr. Johnson, your vote didn't count. You're entitled to recast your ballot in a timely manner. How about I just whisper it to you then? Right here, we get over it right now, and you can listen to it. <sighs> Those men last night, let's not tell anybody about that. Got it. A single or regular ballot is holding up a final decision for the American presidency. So many. One American citizen will effectively choose the next president of the United States. This is OJ Big. Bigger. All we have to do is win over one American mind. I want to know what he reads, what television shows he watches. Welcome to the party, bud. People really like you, bud. <laughs> they feel like you're one of them. I don't really feel comfortable with this. <laughs> oh, great. 
He's got the Secret Service running fly patterns. What's he gonna do next? Invite the cabinet over for a kegger? I read about you in the paper. They said you'd do anything to win, even if it meant selling your mother's soul. If you met my mother, you'd understand. You should read all this mail you've been getting. People are writing to you for help. I can't, I can't help these people. You can speak for them. Bud! You used to stand for something. Both of you. But what are we about? Winning. <laughs> because if we don't win, you can't do what you set out to do. This is a moment that the whole world will remember forever. You know exactly what you mean, Andy. Do you? Maybe not. The only question now is, who are you going to vote for? Remind me again who's uh, running. <laughs>